Hi everyone! In this video I'm going to show you how to enable or disable 5 GHz band network in any Netgear Nighthawk Wi-Fi router. This can only be done from web interface. Of course you can do it from any mobile browser, but uh, the web interface is not responsive, it's not designed for a mobile browser, so computer is recommended option. Actually, 5 GHz band is enabled by default on setup, but for some reason, if it's disabled in your router, I'll show you how to fix it. So make sure your computer is connected to your router's network, then open a web browser and in the search bar type in routerlogin.net, then hit enter, just wait for a while, and you need to sign in as administrator, so enter your username, enter your password, if you don't know these credentials, there is uh, no way to uh, enter the web interface, so uh, the best option is to reset your router and set up from scratch. Uh, so once you enter the web interface, stay on the basic tab and click on wireless style. So here is your wireless settings. 2.4 GHz, as you can see it's enabled, you need to find 5 GHz. So I'll scroll down until you see wireless 5 gigahertz, so enable this network and don't forget to apply your changes, but before we do it, let me show you one more thing. Also, you can enable Smart Connect. It combines 2.4 and 5 gigahertz network into a unified dual band network, so all your devices will connect at the highest possible speed, and this is my preferred option. So. Uh, you currently have different Wi-Fi settings for 2.4 GHz and 5 GHz network. Once click Apply button, we will override the settings for the 5 GHz uh, with the 2.4 GHz radio settings. It means it will take 2.4 GHz password and network name and apply to 5 GHz network. And this is uh, pretty good to me. So apply settings. Uh, this message you can just ignore, nothing useful here. Now it's updating settings and you see the server error probably because he was disconnected from your router's network. Let's check this. Yes, now I'm connected to different network, so let's reconnect to Netgear. Let's connect. Now let's refresh this page and everything works well. So that's pretty guys, hope this was helpful, consider to subscribe uh, to our channel, hit the like button and be awesome, bye guys!